Oh, evidently I gotta run? Alright, you know what, whatever. I need to do stuff with Lazarus anyway. I must have, uh... Yeah, I must have done something. Why does the ad come after the waiting screen ends? Dude. I think if you think about that question long and hard... You might, you might come up with an answer. We'll do this for a little bit, and then I want to play some Yakuza, because I haven't played in a while, and I should make an effort to finishing that story. I mean, I, I think I'm like two-thirds of the way through it, something along those lines. Mm-mm-mm-mm. <laughs> Is I guess I mean I've been trying to just unlock stuff, alternate path stuff. So maybe I'll stick to that. I'll go with the rule of like skipping the first two items and then the rest I'll uh, I'll grab. Oh, damn it, it's a labyrinth, I didn't realize. Alright, whatever, it doesn't matter. I need to be more careful. Oh, this is a little cursed. <laughs> that almost got me. Ah, oh, crap. I wasn't paying attention to that. Oh, well. Maybe I can get lucky and get a health up or something. Uh, hold up. Chances back up to 100%. I don't know, maybe because I died? No idea. Maybe it's a thing specific to Lazarus, who knows? That's weird that they stop short. <laughs> okay, cool. Yeah, 
that's uh that's rip <laughs> Little sad. Absolutely not. <laughs> Get that wretched thing away from me. Hope for a black rune or Perthro. Oh, that's annoying. Not worth it. Okay. Oh. Uh, see, that's interesting. I could take advantage of the trinket for this treasure room. Uh. Fuck's sake. It's not necessarily a bad idea. I guess I can see what it is. Oh, we got the planetarium. Alright, then that might change things a little. This had better be good. I don't know if I should do the crown thing anymore now. I haven't gotten this one before. Effects don't seem immediately obvious. We'll see what it does. I'm sure it'll become obvious soon. I seem to have a knack for getting rooms that are annoying. want a prolonged fight. Oh, okay. Well, there you go. That's obvious then. Eh, I mean, it's not bad. One sec. That's a little unfortunate, but I'll take this. And I guess I'll deposit the rest.
Yeah, let's stick to the Empress. I notice I can see the boss room as well. Useful. Okay. Uh, <laughs> I used to be a, I used to be a fan of this item, but lately it's just been I don't know. It doesn't feel good anymore. I don't know if they, they've done something to it, or it just feels off, but... Oh, no. Yep. Sick. And I probably don't have a defense for this anyway. I really hate these flies. And add insult to injury. <laughs> Gives me the item that could have saved my ass. Yeah, this is probably going nowhere. Like, these eyeball shots are terrible. I mean, like, it's nice it reveals the map completely. Wait, I saw a soul heart. No, I mean, they used to be good. I don't know. I felt like they were alright because they lingered, but... Puberty. I guess keep going. It's not really gonna do anything here. Like I don't, I don't really have health. I don't really have damage. It's and my tears are really bad. They don't have enough speed, so the enemies easily avoid it. I'm not even sure I'll get to the point where I got the character unlocked, to be honest. Yeah, that's not gonna not gonna be saving me.
I mean, I'm not one to call it quits, but it's very tempting at the moment. Not gonna lie, this is a little annoying to play. It's almost beneficial to die at this point. Why are the shots as bad? It's the eyes. It's straight up the eyes, because... The shot speed should not be that bad. Oh, what am I doing? I'm going backwards. I wasn't even paying attention. Ah, mm. uh, whatever. I don't care. <laughs> At this point. Nah, I'm tired of this. This is so annoying. Let's just restart. I think it's quicker. Range paralysis. I can see forever. Okay. Oh, this feels so much better already. That was just way too annoying to play. Nice to be able to hit things easily once again. Well, you know what? I was skipping the other stuff as well. Very, very interesting. Don't, don't you fucking dare take that away from me. It's fine. Like, it's... I guess it results in a similar effect. It's almost, yeah, like I'm set up to do devil deals on this now. Because that's insane, like I, I can... Hmm. Like if I force myself to die, then... Anyway, we shall see. He's not expecting that to happen. Shit. The 
seem to be really good at getting annoying floors. Okay. Leave that there. That's that's going to be a utility. I could force an angel room right away if I wanted to. Honestly, it wouldn't be a bad idea. Okay, well now I'm definitely doing it. Oh, yeah, go, go hit yourself again. Is that another health up? I can't remember. No, it's this. Okay. Gee, there sure are a lot of pills. Okay. Oh, well. Alright then. Yeah, I mean, let's see what's up. Oh my god. I was trying so hard not to get hit. Okay, it's fine. We can still do something with this. Oh, this tier 8 is so much better. Okay. Three stats. Um, yeah, let's just... Put a pin in that for a sec. Huh. Yeah, 
I was trying to iframe that, but it didn't work out. It's okay. Cool. Okay, back in a sec. It's a purpose for everything. I'm gonna do something I need to do, which is this. Okay, knife, money, demon. Okay. Like, this was a very ballsy move, but I think it'll hopefully pay off. Fucking spiders. Okay, I can't really see where the end goal is. No, there's, there's something, there's an item achievement thingy to get a run done in under 20 minutes, and this is the way to do it. So I figured, go for it. If it fails, it fails. I don't think Guppy's Herbal's gonna help me at all here. Oh yeah, you can't do that. I think I just got unlucky with the rooms. Okay. Oh my god, this fucking darkness shit. Nah. Oh well, I tried. I was kind of hoping the dark room items would be something really good. But they weren't, so... Worth a shot. It's not an easy thing to do. Like, you can rush through it. Just that is an alternate way. It's probably easier to do that with a Zazzle, but... Oh, wait. I forgot. No item rooms. Nope, not starting like that. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I will have to try for it at some point. I think Maggie's probably the best one. Starts off with a lot of natural health, and as long as you get the heart thing, it works. And then you just gotta hope that the Devil Room items are good at the end. I know I probably could have turned that run into something else, but... 
the spur of the moment decision. definitely one of the more annoying room designs like this shit here Stop it! <laughs> How many do you want to summon? Okay, back in a sec. I just want to say that I'm not missing out on anything. That'll do. Dice room, uh, Castle of the Blind. Oh, this is. This is very early, but I'm kind of game to do it. It wouldn't affect me that badly. I guess let's just see what item I get. Hey Nick, how's it going dude? d right now only affects the cube of meat. You mean d only affects the item I have? Damn. I thought it was going to affect the other 10 items I have currently. 
I mean, the, it kind of goes without saying. Planetarium? I know. I think what I'm gonna do... I'm gonna fight the boss, see what I get, and then probably de use the dice. And then get the planetarium item. Okay, so question. If I don't get this item, is there a chance I can get a second one? Like, let's say I don't pick it up. It doesn't change my odds. As long as I don't go in there. And then I can get this one on the ascent. Check what it is. Maybe it's worth re-rolling too. I thought the chance only goes down if you go into the room. It's a re it's a it's a re-roll for not pedestal re-roll, it's a re-roll for me as a character. You fucking dick. Yeah, it's possible to encounter multiple times in a single run, but if Isaac enters a planetarium. So I think the key word there is if I enter it. But if I choose not to enter it... Planetariums will not generate during the ascent, nor will skip planetariums reappear. Okay. Alright. Well, that makes sense. Alright, then in that case, there's no point in doing this. However, I will still fight the boss and then come back to it. I'm gonna eat shit. I'm doing that quickly. Um... I'm doing this because fuel to the fire. Down. Okay, I'm gonna see what it is. I'm not gonna pick it up. If it's bad, I'll re-roll it. Alright, I can't see what it is. Uh, alright. In that case, I'll just... I'll go. Hang on. A bad one. Interesting. Whoa. Yeah, I would say that reroll really helped. Oh, okay. And I got the nail as well, dude. Perfect for Devil Deal runs. I just have to watch for the bum steals. Yeah! But I did a devil deal technically, like if there's a sacrificial altar, that'll be pretty good. Uh, no thank you. Okay, let's do this. I'll use it on the next floor. Yeah, I'm gonna go have a look what else I can get out of this. Oh, I'm aware. I've, I've had this before. This isn't the first time. Oh. 
gotta be careful. All right, we're good. Pretty good. I already got the secret room. Didn't I? No, I didn't. My bad. Thought I had already gone into it. Damn it. I could have re-rolled that too. Tears up. Anyway, it's fine. It's no big deal. It would have been the same thing either way. Because I would have had a spare pedestal item. So, it doesn't matter. Um... Yeah, I mean... I could go alternate path instead, but I think I'll just stick to my goal of the beast. Yeah, I gotta be careful of this stupid key bomb. That helps. I'm going to take a few and then eventually I'm just going to let him take everything. These calculated gambles, they worked. Oh, what the fuck? That thing was behind me. Alright, it's cool. The theme of today seems to be ob obnoxious rooms. Yep. I'll wait. Man, come on. Okay, taking that, gonna buy the battery. Surprised I'm dropping the drawer breaker. Why? My luck is pretty bad. Uh, sure. That'll do.
Drop it in the boss room. I am, I am. Chill. Jeez. Turn down the back seat a little. I know what I'm doing. I'm probably gonna stick to this one, because then it lets me go in cursed rooms. Plus, I seem to have been getting a lot of obnoxious rooms, and at least this way it combats that. And I can get more items that could potentially transform me. Taking this just in case, you never know. If PhD is in the shop, then hey, I have a free pill. Uh, okay, we good. Thank you, fear. <laughs> Oh, well, that's not going to serve a purpose, right? I'll touch it, but... Although, wait, wouldn't it work? Isn't this, like... With Lazarus, you could get away with it. Because he has a second life. Fucking despise those flies. They're so the they're easily the worst thing they've added to this. If you use it on Dogma, you get your second life back for base. That's just a, a very poor choice.
Because you come back with one heart, you don't come back with full health, I would imagine. And then you're just left with one hit. Hmm. Well, I'm not touching that. I'm not having much luck holding on to health. I'm not suggesting you're wondering if it works that way. Well, yeah, you'll... You'll kill it, you'll get your life back, and then you have to fight the beast. That's simply what happens. It's like if you use it on phase one of Mega Satan, then it doesn't kill phase two. You just kill phase one. Depends how quick the death animation happens. But I'm pretty sure that it's not quick enough. Hang on, I should be drinking my water. <laughs> Otherwise, it's gonna go to room temperature. Okay. Yeah, I mean, I don't think it's worth finding out, to be honest. Okay, easy come, easy go. I got money as power, that's good. At least now I have health I can hang on to. Ooh, the fear shot makes this a little erratic. Uh, I mean, this is technically better because it gives health. And I can build it up over time. I know this is better ultimately, but... Oh, mm. I'm thinking about it. No, because I'm doing Devil Deals, so I think I should just stick to this. I keep getting curses. This is why I love this trinket, it's just 
that removes the danger of these things and later on those really annoying ones. I'm gonna let him start taking the keys now. I've got 10. That's a good surplus. Wait, what? Empty heart. It multiplies. Never gotten this before. Evil charm, lock up, plus you feel protected. Uh, I know it's a damage down. Okay. That's good. and negated the speed down. It gives you a heart container if you have one heart or less when entering a floor. What, one red heart? Yeah, then that's that's very good for devil deals then. Yeah, I guess if you're Lazarus Pretty good too. If you're down to your final heart, it just restores it. This means passive will always go off. Yeah, I mean, I'm just saying what I can get out of this, pretty much, buying myself time. Justice. I'm gonna take the key. saying what extra money I can get and what if I can charge up the nail a bit more oh you can break doors down too forgot about that it still feels like it's not really doing that much okay well Yep. 
That's quite the way to start a fight. This is so annoying. <laughs> Just... Taking it. Alright, good. Yeah, I mean, pretty good for devil deals. Fuck. I can't get that. Unless I get flight. Shoot the rock from the bottom. Oh, it makes a bridge. Okay. Cool. I thought it didn't make bridges. Because it's not an explosion. How many curses have I got in this run? Fucking hell. I feel like every floor has had a curse. I don't know if it's just me, but it certainly felt that way. That trinket would have been useful, but nah. Okay, there's the escape. Justice. Uh, so I would have. Two red hearts at this point, right? One, two, three, four. One. What about the black one? Or is that, like, not real? Oh, it's not a red heart. Okay, then. Well. That I don't know. Okay, I mean, I got damage out of it. It doesn't particularly matter that much. Yeah, but I picked up a red heart. I guess that's what I'm saying. Oh my god, fuck these curses, honestly. I'd be able to see what was going on, but every single floor has been a curse. Oh, 
Oh my god, I'm an idiot. <laughs> I walked out on it. Oh well. I didn't think I was gonna go, so I kind of autopiloted. Okay, well, this is definitely full hits. So let me go do that. I guess. charge it up again. I'm, I mean... It's always possible that it could have gotten, uh... Okay, take that. I, put it, I probably could have gotten the item. It's just unknown at this point. really worth it here. There's another way to do this. I'm not really going to use Yara for anything else. It hasn't... Eh, uh, hang on. No, I'll do it this way. Put it out here. I'll still keep it. Okay, now do this. No, nah, I thought about it. Because there's still a chance I can get, like, multiple chests on the next floor. That's why I chose against it. Oh, I need to get the full card back before I continue. It's 
in one of these rooms. Devil. Also, sorry if I'm, like, not perceptive to, like, the semi, uh, hints and advice. I've had one of those days where, like, people have been pointing out the obvious and I'm just not in the mood. Yeah, I seem to have gotten pretty unlucky with the rooms today. Okay, uh, do that. That other one's not worth it, right? I can't- I, alright, I'm getting this one, but this one, that's not a second life. That's Shadow. I can't remember, because I have the same fucking item. That's the one where it creates- That's Shadow, yeah, I thought so. Yeah, it's not- it's not the second life one. The icons are very similar. Alright, let me go get Yura back. Okay. Nice. Yeah, the pill pl placebo is another one. At least with Ananemia and Bloody Rage. At least with that one, I've learnt it. these assholes, honestly. They're so bad. That little... What? Okay. I should have yared that. It's cool. Go away! Uh, sick. That's... <laughs> uh, should I? I mean, what else am I gonna use it for? Huh. Well, no. I think this one should be the one I got. Yeah, okay. Hang on. Let's see what this has first. Okay. Oh, yes. 
I imagine that's uh, in reference to the Wario video. I should probably do it here. Yeah, I'm doing it here. Okay. This just ensures that I get it without... Oh, good. Perfect. Interesting. Hey. Hey, hey, hey. Would it give me my heart back on the ascent? Like, every single ascent, I get a heart container back. <laughs> Haven't started to watch it. Fair enough. So, the only- the only issue is the Mate Boy is pointless in the final phase of the fight. That's the only- Alright, but that's the thing, it could make, it could make, uh, what's its face, Dogma easy. I should look at it from the point of view that I would lose less health against Dogma. It's probably still worth it. I should just do this in all honesty. Okay, ow. Fuck this thing, honestly. Okay, we're at 99. Uh, I will choose to get this, just to restore a little balance. Okay. Oh. Nearly missed that. Yeah, no shit. That's, uh, that's pretty legit. It also increases my damage, so it's not all bad. Oh, this thing's so annoying. Ugh. Okay, up we go. I thought I was saving time there.
Okay, and I think now that should be good. Because I wanted to keep, like, one meat boy and then one... Uh... Well, one that's like an orbital that shoots, pretty much, and now take the Book of Belial. So this, this has worked out pretty nicely. Um, I might be able to get another one out of it, but I don't know, we'll see. Okay, that's fine. Man, I'm just getting fucked by these flaws. Oh my god. I mean, as long as I got the character unlocked, to be honest, it's fine. For it. get a full heal anyway when we get there, so that's fine. anyone has spare time, could they help you? With what, cat? What do you need help with? Also, hello. And Lelo, thank you so much for the 27 months, dude. How's it going? <laughs> Jeez. Slice your throat open and end the misery of the damn cold you got. You don't appreciate your nose when it's filled with snot. Okay. I thought you legitimately needed help with something. As long as it's just a cold. Alright, I've achieved what I wanted to achieve. That... Is that Two-Face? Eh, alright, whatever. <laughs> okay. Well, let's see how this goes. Ugh, this thing's such an asshole. 
I actually hate this part of the fight more than the second part. His AI can be ridiculously unfair. Yeah, I mean, it's it's a front-loaded difficulty for whatever reason. You would think the later forms are the harder forms. Fuck. Oh, come on. <laughs> yep. Cool. Okay. Well, whatever. I got what I wanted to get out of that. Which is the character unlock. Alright, who's left? Maggie. Blue Baby. Napoleon. Forgotten. Bethany. Not touching that one. Okay. Let's try Maggie. Yeah, no. <laughs> just a cold. If I get there, you'll show me what a cold is. Well, I just... I don't mean like it's nothing. I mean, it could be... Given what COVID is still around. And it shares the same symptoms. I guess that's all what I'm saying is like... At least it's not COVID. I'm not trying to say it's nothing. That's the shitty part, is like, you get flu-like symptoms, you gotta be worried about that. Oh, it's... Damn it. I forgot it was a... A labyrinth floor. Oh, well. Well, now I don't have to stress about taking damage. I forgot! <laughs> I'm an idiot. I forgot. I don't want to be going in item rooms. It's just so easy to autopilot. You have a decent collection of knives good for throat slicing. It's a hell of a thing to admit, dude. <laughs> I'll probably just get this character unlock and then, uh, move on. I didn't want to play this all night. I just want- I just want... something out of today. Oh. 
That took a while. Uh, hmm. On the one hand, the health is good. On the other, this is going to make it painless to clear stuff. I'll probably stick with it. Leave that for a minute. I'll get out at the end of the the room. Oh, it didn't recharge. I, I thought it would have. Okay, doesn't matter. See, now all that's made me think is like, I need to get better kitchen stuff. <laughs> I got stuff from Kmart and Ikea, it's not exactly the greatest. Do I not have a decent knife set? No, no, not at all. How do I prep my chicken? Uh, I mean, the IKEA knife does the job, it just takes a little bit of extra effort. I've tried sharpening it, but it's just, it's a pretty dull knife. IKEA, yeah, when I got it, I moved out and, uh, I mean, budget, right? <laughs> I just, I've never replaced it with a better one. There's no need to replace Sweden. Is it Swedish though? It's not like the knife is made in Sweden. I'd say authenticity is, uh... Yeah, that's too much of a long-term gamble, that one. 
Well, authenticity is, uh, yeah, questionable at best. Why do I keep getting these obnoxious rooms? I just had bad luck. Okay, we're done here. Why don't I keep getting better at these rooms if I keep getting them? I don't know, probably the same reason why you don't finish the Cosmic Ocean despite playing the game over and over again. Repetition doesn't guarantee success. Because I don't try, yeah. I don't try and I still finish the Cosmic Ocean. Wow. <laughs> yeah, it's a, it's a bit of an annoying room. It's okay. I didn't use the laser, so... Alright, just... Ugh. That's not gonna help in the slightest, that's gonna make things worse. Yeah, but in general, I, I do need better kitchenware. I just I haven't bothered. <laughs> Probably should. Yeah, I'll take that. That's good. This would let me reveal if I've got the thing. Okay, don't, don't you dare. Then I could just see on the map and go for it right away. Uh, come on. Uh, Alright, come on. One penny. There you go. And I got my bombs back. Sweet. Okay, so now I should be able to see if I got it right away. Just don't fall for the ceramic knives, they're balls. Oh, what's wrong with ceramic knives? Also, hold up a sec. Oh my god, no wonder this fell down. I had like one of the foam things fell that fall down, and I I know why. I didn't remove one of the adhesive strips. Let me put it back up for one sec. 
So one of the sides were loose. I'm gonna hold it for 30 seconds. From what I heard, if you wanna get a knife, you should get Japanese ones. There we go. Okay. Mm, you know what? Just throw it in. Wow, I didn't think it was going to give me anything. Okay. Just got to make sure I don't take a hit. <laughs> on this floor. No, didn't get it. You know, for 40% chance, it doesn't seem to be happening. Yeah, jeez, if I didn't have the movement speed I have now, this would fucking suck. It'd probably be over. Nothing's wrong with them, they're just fragile. They're very good at certain things, but overall you're better off with a chef's knife set. Gotcha. Okay, I'm gonna throw myself at the, uh, spike thingy. I need to try and gain some form of an advantage here. This is starting to get a little tedious. I do like that they've changed this so it doesn't alter your, uh, your odds of getting an angel room. Okay, good. I'll leave it like this for now. I don't want to overdo it. No, what I mean is you don't lose it. Like before... When you would take the red heart hit, you would lose... Like, let's say it was 100%, it would go down to 30-something. And then you would get the blessing and it would go back up. But now, it stays at the same rate regardless of the hit. Okay, there's, there's the advantage that I've been looking for. 
It's not as amazing as it used to be, but it's a big deal. Okay, uh, I'm just gonna go there now. Shit. Oh my god, I hate this boss so much. He all he always snipes at least one hit on me. Hey. <laughs> okay. Well, let's see what else we can get with this since infinite bombs for the floor. Okay. Yeah, I can do this. I'm gonna get the money out to get the more options thing. I'll be back. Okay, that heart's going anyway. What is that? Oh, oh, right, this thing. Yeah, 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 yeah. Cool. We've got, uh, angel- like, the equivalent of brimstone for angels. Oh! I remember this being bad. But it's a rare item, so I need to take it. Okay, back in a sec, I'm just gonna get health. No, I have greed is is annoying to use from memory. It does more harm than good. But it's only if you care about money. Which I don't really. Let me just use this here. Oh shit. Whoops. My bad, my fuck up. <laughs> it's okay, I should still be able to do it. Yeah, it's, it's not great. But I guess pick it up. So that I don't have to on other runs. Since it's rare. Yeah, I don't know. I feel like this angelic version of Brimstone is it's not as good. This charge time is uh it's pretty pretty bad. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's stick with this from now on.
I can't be bothered taking out all the mushrooms. <laughs> I'm just gonna keep going. Uh, take that. All right. Did I play Wobble well Dogs? Uh, I did. I did one stream of it. It's all right. It's a bit weird. It's nothing special. Fuck's sake. It didn't give me the- yeah, it didn't give me the planetarium again. <laughs> oh, cat. Thank you for, uh, making it clear. I should have 40%. I almost feel like skipping this one, just to make sure it happens on the next floor. I don't know, it feels counterintuitive to charge that brimstone thing up. It just, it takes so long. Right, you can't- Oh yeah, you were talking about this. Like, you wanna- You wanna get something Lelo related, Lelo. To put on your, uh... Put up as a decoration, but then make sure people don't know what it is. It would be funny. Oh dear. I just think today is not my day in this game. Yep, health and nothing else. Alright, let's just keep going.
Please tell me. Nope. Still nothing. Fuck me. Lelo has washed for their toys. Could use that as hand soap. <laughs> I mean, it's, it's like a sanitizer type thing, isn't it? I wonder if you could, if the, if somewhere has a re you know what you could do, and this might be a long shot, if they have a retail presence somewhere at an adult store, you could go to one of these adult stores and be like, hey, if you're going to take down one of their posters sometime, give me a call. I want the poster. And then you hang up like one of their advertising posters in your room. Or ask if they have any spare to give. Just some kind of retail marketing. Uh, would that work? I think it would, wouldn't it? I'm not, or would it fall to the ground? I'm not really sure the interaction of it. Hmm. Guess we can find out. Uh, yeah, pick that up, re-roll everything else. You would 100% put up the Lelo posts in your room. Also, they do have condoms. Well, source it out. Lelo is such a gamer, he has a gamer tag on his condoms. He hands he hands him out before a match, you know? So he's thoroughly protected while he fucks his enemies over. Yeah, I'm setting up one of the- AGAIN with the blue foot! What the fuck is my luck today, honestly? Oh, you dick. Oh, wait, no. I didn't lose it. I didn't lose it. Okay, angel room still acquired. Okay, take this. Oh, good. It's passive. It's not an item that'll help me. Yay. They have a candle. You actually want it. Get it. <laughs> Why not? Uh, I mean... I guess I've got nothing to lose in doing this.
Uh, that is not a good one. That's blood money, right? Converts. Instead of money, it's, uh, health that you use to buy stuff with. Which, no thank you. I got enough money. Okay, I think we're good. There's only one more stall left, so it doesn't matter. Um, I gotta remember to drop the matchstick on this floor. Oh, look what finally decided to appear! How does this work with this? It, 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 it works? Does it work? It does work. It's just very precise hitbox. It's like $35 a bougie ass sex candle. What does it offer exactly? Uh... This could protect me at a point in time where, like... Yeah, it's just random, right? There could be a perfect timing and I avoid taking damage because of this thing, so it's always, I guess, worth it. Wait, it's made from an all-natural soy wax, shea butter, apricot, kernel oil, the lightly scented wax melts into an exquisite pool of luxurious massage oil, available in three aromas. Why don't you just get a, a, like a normal fucking candle and some massage oil? It seems to me like the only thing it does is you can make it a massage oil. Just get another scented candle that's probably better scented and cheaper and be done with it. One makes you small. I found pills. 48 hour energy. Okay, well. Or am I am I wrong in that? Is the Lello brand that important? Like with the girl be, ooh, you sprung out for Lello. Damn. All you care about is that it comes in a fancy candle holder that says Lello on it. <laughs> That's quite the price to pay. But I mean, it, it makes a funny story. At the very least. Okay, drop the thing before we go, and we're good.
I'm hoping that the items I collect on the way up will do something. It's, uh, it's not great what I have. Shit. Get out. Thank you. Scented candles are 20 euros and massage oil is 10, so you think 35 is a good price, I guess. What the fuck are Lello beads? I don't- I don't think I wanna know. You're going down this rabbit hole! Should probably stop. What? Okay. Doesn't wanna... whatever. You're right, you're sorry, you must resist. D I mean, if you want to, go for it. Uh, I guess the onion aura. I think it adds it to this. Pretty sure it does. Oh uh, dear. It seems to be knocking them back pretty well. I don't know if it was doing that before, but... It seems with this sad onion thing, it's doing it more. Oh, I already got that one. Okay. Yeah, I mean, if I keep doing this, they just get stuck in a corner. Oh, boy. Yeah, hold up. I haven't gotten the treasure. Oh. How does... I guess I'm gonna find out, eh? Uh... I don't know if I've fucked up here. I guess we'll see. <laughs> This might be good, actually. It seems to be doing good because the laser's charging automatically every few seconds. Uh, well, let's see. That's going to damage down. It's not really going to increase the fire rate that much because we're already at max.
I mean, that's interesting. I think it'll come in handy. Butter, no thank you. Okay, up we go. Okay. Nope, I'm backing out, I'm backing out. Stop it! Oh my god, whatever. This just becomes way too unpredictable. Okay, I got a little bit of money left. Let's try and get some health out of it. I guess. If only I could take that card with me. Okay. At least the brimstone thing has been made more useful because now I don't have to hold to charge it and I'm constantly firing. Ah, damn it. Okay, well. Okay, let's see how this goes. Again, at the very least, I unlock a character, so... Oh, she's got like a... Hmm, okay. Eh, that's not gonna do anything. Okay, wish me luck. Fucking dick. With, with the instant snipes. At least with this, I just- I just move. I don't have to press the fire button. It's all automated. Okay, now I have to move shit. Oh god. <laughs> I can't control it. This is just gonna be luck. Okay, got it. Nice. <laughs> I was worried that the screen went black for way too long. Did I imagine that, or...? Okay, taking a drink of water. Oh, man. Okay. Let's 
let's see how well this works. One. Yo, this eye, this great eye is, is, is doing work. It seems to be doing a, a freeze, a stun lock. Okay, does this work? It works. Good, so it stays floating. Pretty good so far. Where's my cursor? There it is. Okay. I might actually get this done. Oh, dude, it's clearing the path. Easy. Yeah. Oh, fuck, I forgot about that. It's okay. Yeah, that was very good placement. Like, I don't even have to dodge. It's... Perfect placement. Alright, good. The sky above cracked open. I'll be back in a minute. I'll leave you with this. Down into the earth, smiting the mother of harlots asunder and setting the blood lake to a boil. As the beast descended down into the lake of fire, Isaac ascended towards the crack in the sky, and as he flew, he could see echoes of his past before him. He saw his mother mourning the loss of her son. He saw his father leaving them without turning to say goodbye. He saw his mother sleeping, and his father taking money from her purse. He heard the late night fights they had that kept him up at night, and the guilt he felt for what he believed he was causing. He felt the pain in his stomach during those sleepless nights and saw his shadow in the closet waiting for him. As he rose, he felt his fears drop from his body, his shame, his worry pulled from his being. As he became lighter, his ascent became faster. He saw his one true companion alive and well. He saw his mother and father together again, holding each other. He felt his mother kissing him on the head after he had said his prayers, and the comfort in knowing someone was watching over him. He saw his own birth, and the faces of his parents filled with joy and optimism. And then, he saw nothing. Are you sure this is how you want this story to end, Isaac? You're the one writing it. It doesn't have to end this way. Here, how about we tell it a different way? Maybe a happy ending? Okay, Daddy. Good. Are you getting sleepy yet? Yeah. Okay, so... <clears throat> Isaac and his parents lived in a small house on the top of a hill. Jesus loves to catch you see. 
All right, I came back just in time for the uh, eerie music. <laughs> Jeez. Candy Heart has appeared. All right, so just quick recap. Who's left? So wait, lethal hugs, items heal more. No destiny. I haven't read some of these. Um, okay, so I got one, two, three, four, five left one lock. Okay, noted. Okay, I'm leaving Isaac uh, here for now. So, we'll uh, continue this tomorrow at some point. As long as I get, like, one completion marker and unlock, I'm happy. So, I've achieved that today.